TMI? Oh, well, I'm trying to show you how to save money, people. Money! All right, we're out and about um, shopping. Not really shopping. Getting some stuff done, actually. And while I was just sitting here waiting on the hubs in the phone store, I was going to go over some how to save money. Um, when you go to places like Victoria's Secret or Bath and Body Works, they're actually affiliated together. So, um, which credit cards are a bad thing. But if you have a Victoria's Secret card, you can use it at Bath and Body Works. Did you know that? Um, anyway, I don't know. Credit cards are bad. Um, but they're affiliated together. That's what I was trying to say. Um, so if you actually go in, they ask normally for your email address. Yes, they can send you spam. Um, Bath and Body Works, you can probably get one email a day. Um, Victoria's Secret, I think I got something maybe once a week. Um, but you can set up your folder to as soon as you get one, just have it automatically go into the spam folder or have it automatically go to the trash folder or whatever else. So that way it saves you time. But then you're also getting the perks for giving me your email address. They will send you coupons like this constantly. These are expired, so I don't mind showing you like the codes and stuff. But they normally always have a 20% off coupon, a freebie, and then something that's like $6. And those body creams are up to about $13.50, $14. So it's not really a freebie, but it's only paying um, about half. Um, and then the 20% off, I normally give away because I actually don't use it. Normally, I only go to these stores when I have these coupons. Um, and I use them for birthday gifts, Christmas gifts, anything like that. Um, and a lot of times, it's normally like a free $5 um, lotion or spray. And I get those all the time. Those are good for gift bags, goodie bags, like I said, birthday gifts, anything like that. Um, and sometimes, if you get a big enough stockpile, people actually sell them on yard sale sites with Facebook. So, you can make money there as well. Just saying. Um, and then Victoria's Secret will always send you coupons as well. Normally, once a month, you get um, coupons like this. You'll get like two or three of them. And it'll be like a free panty, which those panties, I think they're like the 1050 ones are up to 1250. Either way, you get one free panty a month. Hello, it's free. Just saying, I haven't really paid for draws in a while, but they're free and they're Victoria's Secret. <laughs> but so yeah, you will. Um, so when they ask for your email address, don't be rude. If just be like, no thanks, or because you know, a lot of times they're made to say that. So try not to be rude to the retail people. But also, if you don't mind having like one email a week or one email per day. All right, back in the car for another save money, save time hack. Um. If you have a Sam's or Costco near you, I'm not sure if Costco does it, to be honest, but I know Sam's does. You can buy a pork loin that's huge. It's like $20, estimated about $20, $25, depending on the pounds, because um, it's normally about $2 a pound. You buy this huge thing there, and it's basically pork chops, just ain't been cut up yet. <laughs> you ask them to cut it up for you. You're getting 20 like huge like it's massive you getting for twenty dollars you're getting enough pork chops for like a month you're basically getting pork chops for half the price seriously all you do go to your sam's go to the meat part find the big pork loin ask them to cut them for you and they can even cut them thinner if you like or thicker you just you let them know the size so i need this cut and you're basically getting pork chops for half price not even lying. Check it out. All right, another time saver. This is going to be a little bit TMI, but you know you've all thought about it. If you're a very busy person, you've thought about it. While you're stuck on the toilet, let's say, you know, because everybody has to go, um, <laughs> why don't you like file your nails, cut your nails, read a book, you know, Catch up on your YouTube subscriptions. Check, you know, check in on your mom. Call somebody. Snapchat somebody. Although, let it be one of your best friends because that'd be like a little weird. Um, you get caught up on emails. You're sitting there doing nothing. And I am, for one, hate any downtime. So, like, I will cut my nails. I'll check up on my emails. Like, <laughs> you're just sitting there. Might as well get something done. I'm telling you, you will save so much time in getting something done while you're just stuck there than trying to do it later when you can't. 
So I'm telling you, give it a shot. You can get caught up on your podcast. I'm like anything. You got a good, well, however long it takes you. You got anywhere from like five minutes to like more. And if you're like a sick day or something, you know, you might have half a day up in there. Just saying, it's worth a shot. Thank you.